Family and community leaders are calling for justice tonight after a 13 year old named Cassidy Jones was attacked and beaten inside a Harbor City McDonald's. That shocking video now going viral. Multiple people can be seen in this video watching the attack. Eventually one person does step in to break it up. The woman seen beating Jones remains on the loose tonight. Eyewitness News reporter Elena Gomez has the story. A routine trip to McDonald's after school turned into this for 13 year old Cassidy Jones. Cell phone video shows a woman hitting the teen inside a Lomita McDonald's. You can see the woman pulling Cassidy's hair and forcing her to the ground before hitting her multiple times. Hey. 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 This happened last Wednesday, leaving Cassidy with bruises on her face and also her mother says afraid since no one stepped in to help her. My daughter is hurting emotionally. She can't sleep at night. She's bruised. She, she doesn't want to go to school because she's tired of the kids and everybody asking her what happened and making fun of her. Today, Cassidy's mom and the community came together to protest outside the McDonald's where the incident happened, calling for the woman involved to turn herself in and for the McDonald's managers to be charged since they did not take any action. I would like for the person that brutally attacked my 13 year old daughter to turn herself in. I know you're watching. I know your family is watching. Um, do right. Do the right thing and turn yourself in. <laughs> Cassidy's mom says that her daughter told her that she went to use the restroom in the McDonald's last Wednesday when her friends went to grab food. When she came out, the woman in the video locked eyes with her, seemed upset, and was saying that she fights kids. That's when Cassidy says the woman grabbed her arm and the whole thing started. There was a lot of kids inside of McDonald's. There was a lot of customers inside of McDonald's. Not one person stopped this fight. You know, it wasn't a fight, it was a beating. No one stopped it. Cassidy's mom also said that she's upset that she hasn't heard from McDonald's to give her and her daughter an apology. As of the latest update, LEPD says this is still an ongoing investigation. In Lomita, Elena Gomez, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.